Hello friends, today we are going to have a quick look into this theme 808 EVB version 3 module. You can use this module to work with EPS, GSM and Bluetooth. Uh, you can insert the SIM right here. And to power up this module, you can use this DC jack. And you have this sliding switch here to turn on and turn off. Uh, this chip is the power chip. To power up this module, you may need uh, 12 volts and 2 amperes. And then there are three antennas. GPS antenna, two over here. Uh, you can connect this to here, and then this is uh, for Bluetooth antenna, and this is GSM antenna. In here, there are some indicators, and then this is uh, this USB jack for update the firmware. You can update uh, the firmware. Uh, by connecting this USB port into the uh, computer and then you can update update the firmware. Uh, in here, uh, it's a why this this question is for a vibration motor. You can connect a vibration motor here and then and we can see there are two jacks. One is for uh, this is for a uh, earphone and this jack is for is to a uh, mic uh, and then this push button uh, you can power up the uh, module through this slide switch and uh, you can turn on the system you can uh, start the system by using uh, by pressing this uh, push button you need to hold it uh, two seconds and then you need to release it then the system will run now I have connected this uh, module with my Arduino and I'm going to power up the module uh, you can also power the module by using a lithium ion battery. Uh, you can connect the lithium ion battery, 3.5 volt uh, lithium ion battery to here uh, by using these two pins. And uh, in this case, I am using this DC jack with uh, 12 volts and 2 amperes. The RX and the TX pins are over here, and uh, this wire is to connect the ground pin with the Arduino. And uh, we can turn the power on by this slide switch uh, you can see this uh, led turned on led indicator turned on the uh, power led indicator uh, and uh, as i mentioned you need to hold this push button for two seconds and then release it one two and uh, you can see these uh, led indicators also gps led indicators uh, turned on uh, which means uh, GPS is active now like this you can connect this module to your Arduino and you can connect your Arduino into your computer and then uh, in computer you have a serial monitor and you can by using your serial monitor you, you can communicate with this module uh, this module use 80 commands to communicate and you can do such a lot of things uh, with this module you can uh, even take calls over this module and uh, you can send SMS uh, and you can know your uh, GPS location and uh, there are some things you know, to do with this module. Do you know friends that we can write Python script to communicate with the Arduino series? Yes. By listening to those composts, we can communicate our Python script with the Arduino series. Wow, from this method you can connect a microcontroller with a microprocessor. It's actually very useful to have. Have a look into my Python Tikinti software which shows our current location on the map. Thank you and have a good day.